What's good, y'all? It's old school, that young dude with my wisdom and an old fool, CEO, two square ENT, LLC. Man, so I've been having shoulder pain on my left arm, and I was thinking my cholesterol was high, and I was wearing, and was thinking I was having a heart attack. My arm would get numb on me and everything. So I went to the emergency room, and I had them do an x ray and a CAT scan. And then I set up a doctor appointment, and I had another x ray done. And uh, I had some blood work done. And so I got my results right. So everything turned out good. Oh, nothing showed up on the x-rays, by the way. But everything turned out good. Cholesterol I was really worried about is good. My kidneys is good, which I was really worried about because I drank so much one time, my eyes turned yellow. But my kidneys is good, thank God. Everything is good. Except for I'm um, uh, pre-diabetes and so that's not good so um, I do eat healthy for the most part of course I exercise a lot um, but on the weekends I do eat a lot of ice cream and during the weekdays I'm always busy and rushing so I'm always going to fast food restaurants and um, different stuff and um, Basically, the best diet for me would be doing a keto diet, which I used to think didn't sound good at all because they're always preaching about red meats and butter. And I'm like, that's what they would tell us to stay away from. But so basically, it's deeper than that. So keto is basically low uh, carbohydrates, you know, staying away from things that break down or turn into sugar. So, um, I went to Panera and I was looking at different things I can get and I was listening to this doctor he was saying um, not all fruits and vegetables is good for a keto diet because of course a lot of it breaks down in the sugar so <laughs> you have to watch everything I guess and so this is all new to me I guess what I'm gonna get is one of them sugar meters and just start checking different things and as I figure things out I'll let y'all know but one thing I did get and this has got a little bit more sugar than what I thought. So I got this uh, strawberry chicken salad. I don't know about all these other fruits in here. I know berries are supposed to be good for antioxidants. But you really just got to research everything. You can't be lazy about your health. Because that scared me. But I am glad that it's just pre-diabetes. So I can turn it back. And then... I'm glad my, you know, cholesterol is good and my kidneys is good. That's one thing I was really worried about. But everything checks out except for the diabetes part. So definitely going to be uh, paying more attention to what I eat. And also they were talking about, what's the word? I can't even think of the word. Um, intermediate fasting, basically uh being more strict when it comes to what time you eat and uh i know i, I can stand the fast myself I, I got that whole dad by going i mean i look good and everything but i, I got a gut too though i ain't gonna lie <laughs> you'll be sitting in the pictures got me second in head but <laughs> yeah definitely a learning experience and i encourage everybody to go get checked out often i'm about to go get um set me up a dentist appointment too here in the near future but yeah definitely glad my shoulder's hurting so i could find this out ahead of time and try to stop it and that's what all getting checked is about trying to stop things before they get too bad you don't want to try to deal with something at the last minute you want to get a head start so yeah man i just wanted to share that with y'all hope y'all have a beautiful blessed day and you're prosperous and prolific in all your ways peace